hyphen plus so this is a key from 360 data. It's time to learn how to use Apple's live listen feature with Beats Studio Pro. iOS comes with a notable hearing feature called Live Listen that allows an iPhone or iPad to serve as a remote microphone for an MFI compatible hearing aid. On Beats Studio Pro and other MFI devices, the Live Listen feature can also be used as a monitoring device because it uses the iPhone as a microphone and relays what the iPhone picks up to the bits. That said, let me show you how it works. First off, open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Then tap on Control Center. Now scroll down and tap on the green plus button next to Hearing to add it to the Control Center. Then put your Bit Studio Pro headphones on and connect them to your iPhone or iPad in the usual way. Then open the Control Center on your device. On iPhone or iPad, without the home button, you just have to swipe down from the top right corner of the screen. And on iPhone and iPad, with the home button, you have to swipe up from the bottom of the screen to bring up the Control Center. Then tap on the hearing icon. Then tap on Live Listen. Then place your iPhone or iPad close to the person you want to hear, preferably in front of them. It's worth pointing out that if the output to your Beats Studio Pro is too quiet or too loud, you can use the volume buttons on your iPhone or iPad to perfectly adjust the volume level. And that's all there is to it. So that's how you can use Apple's Live Listen feature with Beats Studio Pro. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.